Hey everyone, welcome back to another new exciting video. There is a new model in the market for the new year 2026 and the model name is IQS Coder version 1. It is a 40 billion model and this model is beating Cloud Sonnet 4.5, it is beating GPT 5.1, it is beating Kimi K2, it is beating Quen3 Coder. And on their official blog post, they have just uh, posted this benchmark comparison on the SW bench verified, B code bench, live code bench, and also on this terminal bench. They have shown us on this full stack benchmark also that this model is the number one model and it is beating all of others. And also, it is free and open source. Here you see that they have just published these four variants one is the base stage one, one is the base and this is the instruct and this is the loop instruct okay and uh, they are giving the sw range verified 81.4 percent you can understand that 81.4 percent is a huge benchmark okay so uh, if i talk about this gemini 3 pro it is around 77.3 percent uh, but here you see sw bench verified for this uh, iqs coder version one is the 81.4 percent and also they have given some of the proof of their uh, the toughest code forces platform here you see that they have owned this icpc nerc northern eurasia final online mirror okay it has performed well on this coding so basically this is the coding model that they have also written in their blog post a new generation of code llms for software engineering and competitive programming and these are the four variations 7 billion 14 billion 40 billion and 40 billion loop so 40 billion and 40 billion loop these are actually mm, uh, giving the best performance okay and the features that they have mentioned code flow training multi-stage training based on code flow to track code evolution over time and uh, dual post training paths two post training tracks that they have implemented one is the thinking another one is the instruct efficient deployments and also cost optimization and loop architecture and stronger reasoning okay now uh, these are the training pipeline that they have given okay so all these link i will give in description you can uh, just read this document here and they have given some of the uh, outputs okay some of the uh, examples that they have done with this model and look at the 3d solar system that they have made with this model where you see that the center sun and some rays are coming from it and all of the other planets are revolving around the sun and it is actually amazing you can change the speed you can change the angle right and uh, this is the neon space shooter that they have made this is the one of the game this is a complex game that they have made Boyer's algorithm flow kick simulation that they have made this is the okay so these are the uh, information that they have given i personally have not tried this model till now because this model is not deployed by any inference provider and i personally don't have that much space to try it in my local so that's why i am requesting to all of you those who have the capability please download this model in your machine and please do a test uh, for this model okay and uh, let me know in the comment section that if it is working fine for you or not if this model really beating the cloud sonnet 4.5 and it is better than gpt 5.1 or not okay and uh, when they will uh, be supported by any inference provider later then surely i will make another separate video now another news is that uh, here you see top frontier model in the arena 2025 so recently yesterday they have published it because 2025 year got end and now the new year is 2026 so the top frontier models in the arena by the end of 2025 and you see that text plus vision these both combination gemini 3 pro is the top model from google DeepMind. and for this web dev code arena cloud opus 4.5 with thinking is the top model and for the search gemini 3 pro grounding from google DeepMind and also gpt 5.2 search from openai are the two um, uh, number one model text to image so text to image GPT image 1.5 this is a huge uh, achievement from OpenAI that they are the number one uh, image generation model from text and they are easily beating this Gemini uh, 3 Pro model for Nano Banana Pro okay and also for image edit also means for image generation and for image edit chat GPT image latest is the number one it is beating that Nano Banana also 
means it is beating 2k model also for nano banana okay this is a huge achievement on the image generation and edit from open ai text to video model vo 3.1 first audio and vo 3.1 audio from google they are in the top model for the text to video for the image to video they are also uh, vo 3.1 is the top most model and also i have to see that uh, there is a top 10 open model for the text okay the model that I have, I have talked about in this list these were all closed source model from the google and open ai now if i compare the top 10 open models in text then glm 4.7 is the number one from the jet ai and then number two is the kimi k2 thinking turbo and number three is the dfc version 3.2 so these open models are performing well on this text category also okay and next the next important news is that manas joins meta for the next era of innovation so this was the unexpected collaboration from manas and meta because uh, no one did not actually uh, expected that this will be happened but yes this got happened here you see that um, the news is out and it is big manas is joining meta and this announcement is more than just a headline it is a validation for our pioneering work with general AI agents. We all know that Manas was focused on building a general purpose AI agent. It helps user to tackle the research automation complex tasks. Means there you can um, just uh, build the slides automatically by giving the information and you can build the website. There you, you can do many things. Okay. So uh, and uh, if you see that Facebook also posted this news and uh, if you see this message this is the actually a great post that I have found on Twitter uh, regarding this Manas and Meta, the full evaluation that why uh, Meta actually invested on Manas. Here you see uh, the fact that so many of tech bros are surprised and never heard of Manas AI by this is itself a tale. Manas has had real presence in Asia for a while and Manas AI does not festicize benchmarks like other frontier labs. It shows as they got from 0 to 100 million a revenue by annual revenue by obeying over their over the end customer workflows like slide docs business operations you get rewarded for actually shipping things customers want okay not impressing them on evals so actually they are solving the real problems of customer uh, they are not just uh, publishing the benchmarks okay so that's why um, that's why meta invested on manas and manas is legit 10x better than chat gpt or v0 for certain tasks they have a unique steps of idea for uh, divergent first and then ruthless convergence which allows it to be a lot more creative in an elegant way and uh, if you are still making slides manually in 2025 you are missing out manas ai clears gamma easily and gamma just uh, has better gtm okay and also there is a funny uh, screenshot that got posted in twitter and this is posted by this uh Jin, you know, because uh, uh see he also uh, got this um, this uh, screenshot on social media chinese social media where mark zuckerberg is telling alexander that manas is pretty good can you buy it for me and then alexander is uh, replying on it done boss and then the reply from mark zuckerberg is did you buy pro or premium okay so these are funny and another uh, post from this person actually this person is a co-founder and cto of hyperbolic you know that hyperbolic is like the same uh, like uh, open router there also you will find different different models and you can use their endpoint and use the api key to integrate with client and vs code and etc uh, etc et meta reportedly acquired manas for four to five billion dollar not sure what is meta buying it for but one thought manas hit 100 billion annual revenue just eight months after launch this is a huge achievement for a startup okay first startup did this ever it has um it has no proprietary proprietary model people call it an ai wrapper yes because um there are many this kind of model like uh, previously that browser um, automatically browser will open so that kind of uh, things are already there was in the market but manas did it in a uh, in a good manner in a good way okay so that's why it was an ai wrapper same critique was used on cursor okay and means they build actually a browser agent but previously there was different different browser agent but that was not that much uh, useful in a simple way okay uh, for using that previous uh, browser agent uh, you need to set up the configuration and there are there were many challenging but they have made it in a simple way that's why manas got popular people keep assuming a small update from openai or google will wave out a lot of ai startups but in reality, the AI application layer should be where most of the opportunity is. So this kind of small, small uh, AI application layer startup 
will actually give the credit opportunity later so they are actually performing well i hope that from this video you got to know new you got to know many things from this video if you found meaningful information please don't forget to subscribe to this channel don't forget to like this video also see you guys in the next video thanks for watching bye bye take care